once he'd taken it. He didn't really have the chance to get the pass in. Brown. Good tackle there from O'Gara. Fells the big second row, but on the floor goes Quinlan. Lost to Warren to get their hands off it, but it's Munster who are ripping Gloucester hands off it. And now Howlett thinks it's on from deep. This will be very interesting indeed as the centres combine. This is Murphy looking for Topoki again. Topoki gets it outside to Dowling, who's bursting at the touchline. Dowling beats the first man. Morgan makes the tackle, but it wasn't the biggest of hits. And Munster now lining up, waiting for quick ball. O'Leary, Murphy, Murphy running hard. He's got men outside. O'Connell can see that. O'Leary again. Howlett, who started all of this with that vision of hits. Referee holding out an arm and Munster making sure that everybody on the ball knows that. Dowling's surge forward has created this. Leamy. An exciting counter-attack from Munster as we approach the interval. O'Leary short to Quinlan. O'Leary once more. Both sets of supporters realising this is a key time to lift their men. Wallace carried three defenders there. Howlett. Quinlan. I suppose he started all of this with a turnover. O'Connell. Very strong there from O'Connell. Munster looking for a way through. Leamy thinks he's found it. O'Leary again, short. Quinlan again. Wood dives in. Thomas O'Leary short once more. On it goes from to Pokey. Now it's Howlett. Dowling chance here in the corner. Dowling no, he's going to score. It was coming, wasn't it? From the moment Wallace carried into three Gloucester defenders, Gloucester were always struggling to get the numbers there. And once again, Rui Tapoki's broken field play is just sucking Gloucester players to him, and it's creating space wide. Leslie Vinacolo decided, rightly, that he had to go for the ball when it was slung wide. But once he went for it, if he didn't take the ball, it was a walk in the park. And you can see now, once again, Topoki slings that ball away. That has to be made by Vinicolo. Once it's not, Howlett gives the easiest scoring pass to Dowling. And Munster have threatened, and now they've scored. And this is a big lead. And this is one of the best tries of the competition this season, without a shadow of a doubt. Just think of the players involved. Just think of where it started. And factor in as well the total commitment an organisation from Gloucester, they threw everything they had at Munster to keep them out, but in the end, they couldn't. Yeah, and maybe that sums up this first half when Gloucester have been in the Munster 22. They haven't really looked like scoring. When Munster have got there, they have hit them with the sucker punch quite brilliantly. The strength to turn over ball, the speed to go upfield, the execution superb. And the conversion for O'Gara. Well, the ball held its line and O'Gara in the end didn't want it to.